Ndiba ekele mono. E jimna kanaru di chono. Welcome to another episode of Asusuibo. Today, we will be looking at alphabets in Igbo. Mure de me de Igbo. There are 36 letters of Igbo alphabets. Eight vowels and 28 consonants. Let's take a look at them on the board. We have them clearly written on the board. I'm going to say, pronounce them. Please make sure you follow the sound and say after me. A, B, Ch, D, E, F, G, B, G, G, H, I, E, J, K, B, Q, L, M, N, N, W, N, O, O, P, R, C, Sh, T, U, O, V, V, Y, Z. Don't worry, I will take it all over again. Um, if you're having difficulty pronouncing it, don't worry, I'll take it over and I will teach you a song because it's very, it's very fun to learn alphabet. I'll teach you a song with it. Now I want us to take it line by line. A, B, Ch, D, E. We'll take it again. A, B, Ch, D, E. One more time. A, B, Ch, D, E. Is that okay? Let's go to the next line. Fege we ye gwe. Let's go. Fege we ye gwe. One more time. Fege we ye gwe. Let's take the third line. He e e j k. Let's go. He, E, A, J, K. We'll take it again. He, E, A, J, K. Now let's take it from the beginning to K. Let's start. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, W, Y, G, W. He, E, A, J, K. We will still take the song, but let's run down, then we'll start with the song. Let's continue from the fourth line. Be, que, le, me, ne. Be, que, le, me, ne. Let's go one more time. Be, que, le, me, ne. The next one. Nye. There is a dot here. So it's not ne, but nye. Let's take it. Nye. 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 O. O. Because of the dot underneath. Nye. 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 O. O. Let's take it again. Nye. 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 O. O. The next one is P, R, C, Sh, T. P, R, C, Sh, T. Again, 
P R C C T. And the last one, U O, because of the dot on the U O V V Y Z. Let's take it again. U O V V Y Z. Good. Clap for yourself. Um, I would like to take the song. It's very, it's very simple and uh, it's a very popular song. It's a song that goes like this. Just as if you are singing Queen of England, Queen of Ireland, Queen of every land and climb. It's that kind of song. I will, I will sing it alone, then you will join me the second time. I bet you the fake way way. He e e j k be kwe le me ne ni we ni o o pe re se she ti u o v w i e z. You get the sound now. So we're going to sing it together. Let's start. Want to go? I be che de e fe ge we ge we he e e j k. Be quickly, mene ne we ni o o pirisi shiti o o vi we yes. Good. I hope you are enjoying this class. I hope you are having fun. Okay, we'll take it again before we we'll go into vowels. Let's sing again. Sing along. I bet you the fake way we he e e j k. Be quickly, mene ne we ni o o pirisi shiti u o v w i y e z. I want you to practice this on your own. Don't forget to practice. Good. We're going to separate the vowels from the total alphabet. Let's remove the vowels. I told you earlier that we have eight vowels in Igbo alphabet. Looking at the board, you see the circled alphabets. They are the vowels, eight of them. A, E, I, E, O, O, U, O. I'll take it again. A, E, I, E, O, O, U. Oh, good. I will write them out separate, then we will sing the song because we have a song also for it. <music> Having looked at the vowels on this side, I'm going to write them out now for you to see clearly. Vowel, it's odaume, odaume in Igbo, odaume. So we are looking at odaume, and I told you that there are eight, and the uh, eight means asato. So eight vowels, odaume, asato, a, e, i, e. O, O, U, O. Like I told you earlier that I will sing a song for you. I will sing it first, then we'll take it together and over again. O dao ma sato, o dao ma sato. A, E, I, I, O, O, U, U. A, E, I, I, O, O, U, O. Did you enjoy that? We're going to sing it together now. Udao ma sato, udao ma sato. 
A E I I O O U U A E I I O O U O Did you get that? Let's sing again. Udao ma sato, udao ma sato, a e i i o o u o a e i i o o u o. I hope you are enjoying this class. Like I told you, learning alphabet is fun and it's also very simple. But make sure you don't forget the songs because the songs will help you remember them easily. Now we've extracted eight vowels. We still have the remaining ones, which we call consonants. In Igbo, it's called mbochume. Can you say that after me? Mbochume. So I'll write it down and I'll extract them also. Mbochume, there are 28 of them. These are the consonants. Mbochume. We have 28 of them. That's Ireal, Bona, Sato. That's the meaning of 28. So there are 28 consonants in Igbo. They are, I'll take them now. Okay, let me take them first. B, C, D. F, G, B, Y, G, H, J, K, B, K, L, M, Ne, ne, we, ni, pi, ri, si, shi, ti, vi, we, ye, z. So these are the consonants from Bochume in Igbo. So we are going to start from the beginning again. I hope you've not forgotten the song, the Abiche the song. Can we sing it? One more time. Abiche de e fege we ye we he e e je ke be kwe le me ne ne we ni o o be re si shi te u o vi we ye ze. I bet you the figgy wiggy wee he e e j k be quilly mini ye wing ye o o be resisted o o v we yes a clap for yourself let's go over to the vowels or down me Udaume, we're going to sing it too. Udaume sato, Udaume sato, A E I I O O U U, A E I I O O U O. One more time. Udaume sato, Udaume sato. A E I I O O U U A E I I O O U O Good! Clap for yourself. Uh, the last one doesn't really have any song. Pardon me for that. But it's, it's also very simple. So let's run it through. Let's run through the Mbochume, the consonants. Let's, let's start. B Ch, d, f, g, w, y, g, h, j, k, b, k, l, m, n, g, w, y, p, r, c, sh, t, v, w, y. Z. Good. Thank you. So if I ask you to sing through, will you be able to do that? Please make sure you practice. Practice the song. Don't forget the song. Practice 
practice, 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 practice. Don't forget, I, I keep telling you that practice, you only learn faster when you practice. Welcome back. Earlier on, we, we, we talked about the alphabets, we sang the song. We've also looked at the vowels, odaume, and the consonants, mbochume. Now, we're going to separate the vowels. We have two types, the light vowels and the heavy vowels. We're going to separate them now, and I'll teach you also how to form words using the vowels. Now let's look at the board. We have light vowels and heavy vowels. Odaume mfe and odaume aro. We have odaume mfe as a, e, o, o, a, e, o, u. Let's take it together. A, e, o, u. Why do odaume aro, the heavy vowels are a, e, o, u? Let's take them together. A, E, O, U. Now, when you want to form a word from the alphabet, the vowels, the vowels in this category go together. You form words from the light vowels together and the one from heavy vowels together. You can pick a vowel from the, the light and the heavy to form words. Now, let's look at the title. The, Asusuibo here. If looking at asusuibo, you can see that we have a, uh, we have o mixed up together. That's from odamfe, odaomenfe, light vowels. Then looking at the word ibo, looking at the word ibo, you will see e and o. That's from heavy vowels. So while forming your words, you pick vowels from the same category. You can pick one from the heavy and pick another from the light. Let's also look at odaume. Can you pick the vowels there? Where can you categorize the vowels? Let's look at them together. We have oda, then ume. These two words joined together. So the first three letters are from light vowels, oda. Then ume, the last three letters, combined from heavy vowels. Odaume is actually two, two words joined together. So the first part of it is oda, that sound. The second part of it is ume. So putting them together, that's the only way it can go together because they are two different words formed together. But when you are forming your words, you can't combine both. Looking at mfe, it's only e, uh, only e actually that is there. So I want you to start from today to look out for it. When you see any Igbo let any Igbo word, look at the word and pick out. Check if they have heavy um, vowels or light vowels. Let's look at example. Let's look at the board for another example. Looking at the example on the board, you can see that the first, the first one, I picked two vowels from the heavy vowels, the E and E, to form a word. The second one I picked from heavy vowels too. But looking at the third one, you can see I picked from light vowels. So I'm going to give you an assignment now. I will list out words. You help me pray the heavy vowels, the ones with heavy vowels and the ones with light vowels. I'll be right back.
this is your homework or home play. Home play, you're going to do it together. You're going to do it, separate the light vowels, the one with light vowels and the one with heavy vowels. Just separate them. You can do it in a tabular form, high, light vowels, heavy vowels. Then place each word where they belong. Now we're going back to our alphabet. Let's sing that song again. I hope you've not forgotten the sound. We're going to sing it again before we round off the class. Let's go. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, B, Y, G, H, I, I, J, K, B, Q, L, M, N, N, W, N, Y, O, O, P, R, S, S, T, U, O, V, W, Y, Z. One more. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, B, Y, G, H, I, I, J, K, be quickly, mini, ye when ye o o pierce shit, o o v v y z. Thank you. Hope you enjoyed today's class. I hope you had fun today. Don't forget to practice, 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 practice. Till I come your way again. I am Ogotchuku Kemesia. Mm -hmm.